So, uh, several of you picked this one up. Uh, we did tweet out a picture of a fishmonger, which I think made it quite quite obvious. Uh, but hey, you got to make it easy sometimes, right? Um, so, yes, here we are. It is time for us to present to you Nightmare Brewing, which involves a new minion, the Fearmonger, whose ability reads, each night, choose a player. If you nominate and execute them, their team loses. All players know if you choose a new player. So... Basically, the way this is run, and I think you'll like this, it's a fun one. Um, each night, the Fearmonger chooses a player. Uh, you will then mark that player with the Fear token, and we'll announce to everybody that the Fearmonger has chosen a new player. Um, we don't announce that every night, because if they continue choosing the same player over and over again, you don't announce it. But if at some point in the night they choose a different player, you'll announce it then. The Fearmonger has chosen a new player. If the Fearmonger nominates and, and nominates that person the next day and they are successfully executed, their team loses. This only counts uh, if the Fearmonger executes them. So if they're executed by other means, for example, through a Virgin or, uh, you know, someone else nominates them, it doesn't cause the game to end. It has to be that specific person. Is it announced the first night? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Uh, so you're pretty much, unless you're poisoning the fearmonger, you're pretty much always going to know that there's a fearmonger in play. Uh, I think I've pretty much covered the basics. Ed's made a big old document like he usually does. Um, yeah, that's that's pretty much. I think I've covered everything there. There are a lot of corner cases, as you can imagine. For example, a barista caused two people to be fearmongered, and various other fruity things that can happen. Uh. Right. I am going to get set up. To write an actual like <laughs> joke with, with Fearmonger as the punchline, and I couldn't do it. I spent so long. For the sake uh, of chat. So funny. Have I got everyone? So we're a little we're a little running behind tonight, guys. So just give me a sec. Uh, have I got the town square correct in terms of players? Have we had any substitutions? Not That's after I substituted in for Pat. So n I think you're good. No. Okay, so Pat becomes Bardic. I, I'm already no, you, there. You already, so you're already good. done. Yep. Alright, if everyone would like to take the seat, so I'm going to begin building the game. <clears throat> okay, let's do this. That'll do. So we're going to have all of these in. So we'll take we'll take that out. And... Take that out. That should be quite an interesting game. Certainly a, a one that could potentially trap a fearmonger. Let's do the... Mm, yeah, no, I think that's fair. Do you know what? Actually, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to change it to this. Then we're going to we're going to take that out. We're going to take that out. And that. And we'll have this, this and this in. Okay, that's going to be interesting. That's going to be very interesting. Oh, wow, okay. Every time, right? Every time, Wildstar Demon. Uh, Monk, Slayer, and Recluse will be our bluffs, I think. Hello. Hello. Is, Hello. Uh, is everyone ready? Uh, Bardic's just talking, Lixel through, taking the seat with the Jason. Oh, have we, got a, have, we got a, have we got a newbie? Someone who hasn't played on a Thursday before, yeah. Mm. Well, what do they do on Sundays? Yeah. They use MSN right. Messenger or something to run it. No, 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 because... You don't you, have to you, use the... You, you remember how you're using the special tool? Oh, um, right. Okay. We, all, we all have to load a, a thing differently. Ah, uh, okay. In order right. for, for you to do that. I see. Yeah. Yeah, this is something that happens behind the scenes. Yeah. <clears throat> the, the, like, the, the and actual Tyler can't figure out how to do it. Hey. We got it. We got it. All right, cool. cool. <clears throat> Everyone ready? 
Let's do it. Trick question. I don't care if you're ready. Let's go. Okay, let's hand these out. Yes. Okay, right. Uh, we got to make some decisions. <clears throat> so we'll go with... Uh, let's see. Link's all can go with Nikki. Or Richie. Ravenkeeper. Why is Nadine not in the cottage? Not to have the current game role. What's that about? Drag her in. Um, I think we'll make <clears throat> I think we'll make Ekin the drunk librarian. Actually, no, I'm gonna I'm changing my plan. We're gonna introduce Linksol to the Thursday night streams by making them the drunk, and we're gonna tell them that either Richie or Wildstar is the monk. Ekin, on the other hand, will learn that. Bardic. Oh, that's oh, this is gonna okay now. This this will be fun. Akin can learn that either Nikki or Linksol is drunk. That's gonna be an interesting little web to see them uh, untangle. Uh, and as for fortune teller, I think we'll go with. Uh, uh, let's go with Chris. The red herring. Alright, we're good. Alright, guess we go visit Ed first. <clears throat> Hello, Ed. Hello. I'm sure you're pleased to see this. This was 100% random. Okay, this might be hard work, but let's, let's see how it goes. <laughs> Why do you think it's going to be hard work? Um, because people listen to me when I want to nominate in a normal game. They're not going to fucking listen to anyone who chooses to nominate in this. It's going to be interesting. I think you, the real problem that's going to be hard work for you, Ed, is that we're playing Trouble Brewing, <laughs> and you're going to have to deliberately not see certain worldviews where you're the fear monger. <laughs> that is true. No one's going to believe that. Well, anyway, good luck. Uh, Richie is your minion, and Wildstar is your demon. Richie, what's that? Cool, thank you. Chris? All right, Dick. Hello, hello, hello. <laughs> um, I'm just here to tell you that Ed is your minion and Wildstar is your demon. It's it's a dream team. Excellent, eh? Excellent, eh? Good luck. Cheers. Hello, Wildstar. Yet again. I know, continuing the trend, but surely the best thing that you've got right now is that Surely you couldn't be the demon again, right? It's been a while. It's been like three <laughs> weeks. I think people are going to start getting concerned. Oh dear. Well, you can always, you know, you are the imp. You can always top yourself. But uh, your minions are Richie nope. and Ed. And your bluffs are Monk, Slayer, and Recluse. Awesome. All right. Thank, thank you. you. <laughs> yes, Golden Wing. I am aware that fruity means gay. Uh in America, but we're in Britain now, and fruity means unusually interesting. So uh, yeah, I, I prefer I prefer I prefer my definition, honestly. Um, right, we've got oh, it's fearmonger first. Okay. Hello, Ed. Hello. Who would you I like have to, to just shoot in the dark, don't I? Um, I mean, chat. I've got hmm. some ideas, but you can't see that. Uh, let's... Who do I think? I'm not going to execute them day one. Guaranteed. So I need to go for someone that I might be able to execute later in game if they're being even slightly shady. So... Let's go... No, let's go Ekin. He's a good, he's a good like couple of days in player. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright. Thank you. So I could probably just type in chat that uh, the fearmonger is chosen, but I'm actually going to do this a way more fun and dramatic way. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome back. 
I am just here to inform you that the fearmonger has chosen a new player. Good night. Okay. Links all now. <clears throat> Hello, Links all. Hello. You learn that either Wildstar or Richie is the monk. Okay, so that's Wildstar and Richie. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Hello, Ekin. Hello, Ben. Welcome to my library. May I interest <laughs> you in a Stephen King thriller? I, uh, do you know what? I'm actually a pretty big Stephen King fan, so you totally can interest me in a Stephen King thriller. Uh, but for right now, I'm the one who's going to be providing you with uh, information. And that information okay. is that either Linksel or Nikki is the drunk. Linksel or Nikki is the drunk. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. All right, I really hope that works out. Uh, I really hope that one of Wildstar or Richie jumps on that little bluff that we've set up for them. Uh, okay, up next we have got... The Shaft, okay. The Shaft is going to learn a cheeky one. Ian keep not going into cottage. Hello, Nadine. Hello. So you wake up and learn as the shaft that there is one pair of evil players neighboring each other. Thank you very much. Okay. Chris, hello. Hey, yeah. You learn that zero of your living neighbors are evil. Nice. That is my favorite empath number to receive. All right. Is it also your favorite drunk number to receive? <laughs> oh, don't say that. <laughs> Navian, hi. Hello. Who would you like to pick? Okay, so I have a strategy with this that I've not employed before, but I thought about. I'm going to be picking two people um, that are neighbors of somebody else. So if that person happens to be an empath, I've got to read on if their numbers might mean a demon or Ooh, okay. not. Okay, that's that's yeah. sensible. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm going to um, start with Richie and Linksel and work my way around the circle for as long as I can. Richie and Linksel, and you learn that no, neither of them is the demon. Excellent, thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Whew, all right, wow, there's 350 of you watching this, and uh, it could be literally a five-minute game <laughs> because, uh, you know... Ed's pretty persuasive. Let's wake these guys up. At first I was afraid. I was petrified. I did it at the right time that time. You're welcome. Nikki, um, I feel like <laughs> what well, your voice is breaking right now and I don't really know if, if it's safe to have you sing. <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> uh, okay, good morning everyone. There is of course a monger of fear among you right now so uh, be hey. very careful who you nominate yeah. <laughs> good luck have fun okay. our little corner yeah <laughs> come on let's be again. best friends yes let's do it hey. let's do it go uh set to go we are set to go what is this randomizer <laughs> the three of us just always seem to be in a row the, ra the randomizer just loves the drama yep Yep. In those in those things are gonna happen when us three are in the corner. That is here for the drama. Right. <laughs> Evie, are you gonna yeah. tell the truth this time? Um I think I have to. This is my one chance to redeem myself. This is this is a redeeming. Mm, this is this is. Uh I'm I'm happy for all to claim to both of you just for the fun of it. Um Sounds good. And I won't tell the truth to anybody else this game. Cool. Alright. Likewise. I'll commit cool. to that. I'll commit to that too. Right, should we say it all at the same time again? Yep. Three, mm -hmm. two, one, Raven Keeper. Yeah. Empath. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> say Sorry, it all at the same, same. time again. Raven no, no, Keeper. 
<laughs> mayor. Empath. Oh, was, wow. that mayor? was that mayor or slayer? Eevee. Yeah. Slayer or mayor? Yeah. Slayer. <laughs> what? Do you, do you win in the final three or do you kill... I think that was it. Cool. Um. Just going through, I... Ben, the uh, way the fear monger works. But do you want to trade some rolls? Sure. Do you want to do threes, twos? What are you most comfortable with? I, my role is blue, and it starts or and ends with an R. An R. Yeah, Richie. I'll, I'll go for R's. Alrighty. Um, mine. I'll I'll just tell you. I'm either the soldier, fortune teller, or empath. Nice, lovely. Thanks for that. All right. Right. Cheers, bye. Good talk. Thank you. Or won't be telling that to other people, but you can feel free as a, you know, mm -hmm. uh, claiming fortune teller to, to get pings out there if you want. But so far, all I have is a no. All right. Cool. Thank you. Uh, for chat's benefit, we decided to do a one for one. I claimed fortune teller. Bardic has claimed saint. And we are going to do a roll swap. Oh, lovely. Yeah. I want to die. All right. Thanks, Ben. Yeah, no problem. Thanks both Ben's, actually. Oh, yeah. That makes sense. Hello. What, what are you most comfortable with sharing with me? Or how, how would you like to do this? <laughs> I'm down with whatever. I'm very flexible. Okay. I'll do threes with you. Sure. All right. I'll go first in, in all good faith. Um, I am either the soldier, the fortune teller, or the empath. I am... The player, soldier, or mayor. Okay. That's very interesting. Are you sure you're not something else? Uh, yeah. Okay. Alright, well, thank you very much. Oh no, this is not going well. Yep, thanks. <laughs> uh yes i am claiming saint for the moment yes okay uh for chat's benefits uh ben, um uh, navian and myself have claimed librarian and saint uh and uh i have told them that it's not what i saw okay and also that i'm not who you saw which means that you didn't see me in like a drunk ping right Yes, that's correct. Perfect. That is uh, excellent information, then. Thank you, Ekin. Thank you. Okay. Ed is uh, giving me a few of my paranoia. He was like, oh, yeah, let's execute you and confirm you. And you. So I'm like, Ed, <laughs> that's... <laughs> is that what you <laughs> Oh, maybe, maybe he's like the, min the other minion and just wants you to think that. Yeah. To be fair, I'd... if I was like a Baron or something in this game mode, I'd be just like pushing nominations on random people constantly. Yeah, that would be what I would do as well. But anyways, with a drunk I saw, that might be a drunk actually, but we'll <laughs> see if people are claiming it. So, okay, thanks, Ben. Yeah. Great. Okay. <laughs> so that's my <laughs> vague, vague fun bluff. Uh, Recluse, Raven Keeper, Undertaker, Fortune Teller. Oh, and that's that's both. Oh, loads. Townsfolk. Okay. Townsfolk as well, yeah. Okay, cool. All right. Um, well, let's run with that then, because who knows? Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'll, let's go back up and see if one of us can talk. Do you want to fill us in, lads? Cool. Oh yeah. Um, after you, Ed. Yeah. Um, Richie already knew what I was. He's told me what he is. Neither of us have spoken to Wildstar, so we're just improvising at the minute. Um, Richie's claimed that his role either starts or ends with an R, and I've just decided to go out there on a limb and bluff Undertaker because lols, why not? <laughs> um, so yeah, that's where we're at. See you later. Right. Good luck with that. Cool. Evie? Evie, did you want to chat? Let us go. Uh, Navian, should we chat? Yeah, let's go. Oh, 
I might like, not be evil. Yeah, you might not be evil. Hi, chat. I'm just telling Wellstar that I'm catching up on the US streams, and Wellstar has been surprisingly. Evil. You don't need to watch though. <laughs> I don't need to watch. That. <laughs> but there's so much fun. It's it's so much, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All the time. All the time. Well, um, if you're not evil, how would you like to give me a claim from the top 17 rolls on the sheet? You know, I would be happy to claim some number of those characters. Nice. Uh, I haven't hard claimed anyone yet. Okay. Um, wanna make me your one and only hard claim today? Yeah, I'd be happy to. I am the Slayer. Oh, nice. Cool. I am the Saint. How do you feel about doing a roll swap? <laughs> Let's do it. Alright. Cool. I have told you and only you. Awesome. Good job, team. Alright. Cool. We got this. Um, cool, cool, cool. I'll tell everyone that I'm the Slayer and um, hopefully that will keep you alive. That would help all claim things, people. Alright, sounds good. Um, thanks for that. I'm gonna try and catch another chat or two before... That was my Windows noise then that you just heard. <laughs> so don't panic, that wasn't your PC. Oh, We have time? Alright, let's drag everyone back. Back they come. <clears throat> Wow, that was bullshit. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> uh, have a couple of minutes, then we'll open nominations. I go into a chat so I say, all right, uh, let's do this quickly. I'm Blight character, and then we get pulled back. <laughs> I've got no information. I've got, I've got a question here. Let, let's. Who's the easiest person to generally off quickly? Me. Who's the most likely person to nominate? It's Unless... you or Nikki. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, so yeah, if anyone nominates either of those, sus as hell. <laughs> and now that we've called it beforehand, wait for the fearmonger to say they've changed character tonight. <laughs> <laughs> so something has anyone heard of any outsiders this game? Like more than who? Because I've heard of one. I've heard of a librarian um, that's confirming I, one. Uh, a non also a non drunk. Yeah. Oh. Oh, nice. What? I heard of a librarian who saw a non-drunk, and I've heard of a second outsider who was also not what the librarian saw. I heard of a librarian that saw a drunk. Oh. Oh. Well, maybe okay. you should nominate someone, then. <laughs> I mean... Do you want people nominating themselves a bit, generally, or...? Yeah... I mean, People that's not going to last. Themselves. That's not going to last very long, yes, so I wouldn't rely on that. Evil to self numb forever. So, what yeah. we need to do is I just was... kind of get any kind of good, seemingly good nominations, and whoever's pushing for it just get someone else randomly who doesn't really like it to nominate. And so I saw Ivy on stream tell everyone to pick numbers. Do we want to go down that road? This no. is that's very no. complicated and <laughs> okay. not fun. Yeah. I mean, uh, the, the one just thing I because say... this is a new character doesn't mean we need to play everything about the new character. We're playing TB and we're just being slightly paranoid whenever someone nominates and doesn't seem to have a reason. That That's like what's something happening that right a new now. character <laughs> might say. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, has people. anybody heard of a virgin? I would love to nominate a virgin. I have Wait, heard of one. Evie. Chris nominates Evie. Let's... Tell us no. why, Chris. Richie. Richie no, nominates Evie. Sorry, Richie. Richie. Richie, who sounds a lot like Chris, nominates Evie. Tell us why. Um, just like the idea of making everyone a touch paranoid. <laughs> a touch. <clears throat> Evie? Um, yeah, please don't vent up on this. You heard the evil undercurrents in Richie's voice. He's going for the ballsy day one fearmonger win. It's not evil undertones, it is a mild head cold, and I'm a bit <laughs> kind of... <laughs> Uh, I would own, I would like myself to have the only token vote. Thank you very much. Two is not. Oh, bad. It's confirmed, Evo. <laughs> uh, hey, hey, uh, Chris, can I ask you to do me a favor? You can ask. 
Can you nominate Ekin for me? Why? Because I want to nominate Ekin, but I'm not going to play into the Fearmonger thing. Ed will nominate Ekin. Okay. Ed, Ed, Ed I talked with you today. Tell us why you've nominated yeah, but, Ekin. Yeah, but if you spoke with me today, then you can't... You, you're going to have to do this accusation. I don't know why. Um, but um, if you speak with me today, you can't be telling me to nominate for you for a Fearmonger. So Bardic's accusation for me, please. Uh, I, I think that this would be a good um, Undertaker check if there is one. I do believe that this is also in a double claim that I've heard of. Okay, I can. A double claim of a library? Okay. Um... I specifically told Ed to not nominate me for Undertaker check, and he's gone and done it anyways. And I told him I was a little fearmonger paranoid, um, so this bumps up my paranoia a little bit. Okay, interesting. Takes required. I'm just saying, like Bardic oh, asked, this Chris was going I love how paranoid you are, but this is genuinely fine this is frustrating this matter. is why i wanted chris to do it because chris and i haven't talked yeah specifically asked for chris i don't, I don't yeah. yeah i'm not playing the let's just paranoid the shit out of the fearmonger game yeah, like but fearmonger I... is one <laughs> character come enough. on okay so who's the other librarian claim because that's who we're going yeah to i would like to nominate them or maybe not i give will nominate head Aggie, tell us why you've nominated Ed. It just looked staged, and I know Ed said we're not supposed to give in to the paranoia, but I'm probably never gonna get to do this again, so let, let's kill Ed first. Ed? You can kill me first if you like. You'll notice I didn't vote on that to assuage the fearmonger fear. Um, so, yeah, do what you like. Uh, ben, can you clear voting history, please? Ooh, yeah. Okay, six required. We do this. Everybody's paranoid. Interesting. I love it. <laughs> love a bit of love a bit of paranoia. I'm putting Fearmonger on I'm putting Fearmonger and Legion on scripts together and just having a party. <laughs> I had a heretic too, just to just to oh, really God. throw it in. <laughs> Games yeah, last nine goblin. million years as combo. nobody executes <laughs> ever. Can someone nominate me for an Undertaker check? I just want to check something. Bardic nominates Aggie. Yay, Bardic. Tell us why you've nominated Aggie. Uh, Undertaker check. Aggie, your yeah. response? Undertaker check. I don't think you're evil. I don't think Aggie's evil either, but... No. <laughs> Classic, Richie. Classic. <laughs> Six is enough. Aggie on the block. I'll be waiting for Undertakers tomorrow at the tavern. Oh, no one wants to talk about this librarian uh, double claim. Richie, not a sticky. Richie, I believe you've already nominated. Ah, bollocks. Yeah, bollocks. you nominated Evie, I think. He's, he's horny for the noms. Final call. I am. <laughs> uh, Ekin nominates Nikki. Ekin, tell us why I've nominated Nikki. I defer to Richie. Um, no panic, Fraggy. I was about to end. Um, let's kill people who, like, let's not kill people who just want to get Undertaker confirmed. Let's actually try and kill. You know, people who could be evil demons, minions, etc. Okay, seven twig. Oh, sorry, Nikki, you get a defense. Oh, thanks. I see how this is. <laughs> um, yep. Screw. No, I won't get a defense. <laughs> Screw no. <laughs> okay, <laughs> seven to <twig. laughs> execute. Wait, how is that defense working? Like, I'm, I'm impressed, but three votes. It was good. It was good defense. Thank it you. wasn't a defense, it was a bad. Right. It was very right. coherent. Very Everyone's going to use the screw no was... defense now. <laughs> it was nearly as good a defense as his offense on himself was in the game earlier. Yeah. <laughs> Just scream at people and expect them to vote like he wants them to. <laughs> at least this time it worked, you know. Final call. 
I found it hilarious that you guys thought that people were going to vote for that. It's like, you literally Maggie just shouted at people for a minute. And dies. The game continues. Everybody goes to sleep. Thank goodness. So I appreciate we've probably got some uh, some relatively new viewers who've, who are wondering why a board game stream has 350 viewers and have wa wandered over from the main page or whatever. So uh, welcome. This is Blood on the Clock Tower. It is a social deduction game where a small number of evil players, these red tokens here, uh, are taking on a large number of good players. The good team's objective is to kill the imp, which is this person here, They're the evil team captain. Once the imp is dead, the game is over and the good team's won. The evil team are trying to keep the imp alive because each night the imp will kill someone, and when there are only two players left alive, providing one of them is the imp, the game is over and the evil team's won. I've already seen a question, why didn't Bardic die when they nominated Aggie? That's because the Virgin's ability only works on townsfolk, and while Bardic is on the good team, he is in fact an outsider. Wow, it's been a while since I've had to do that explanation. And I absolutely nailed it. Uh, let's let's see what Ed wants to do. Oh, Ed, so close. I know. <laughs> I thought not voting might actually help on it. I don't. Th I think a hand would, a true would have dropped, especially with the people that voted. If I'd voted, so you know. Yeah. What What are you thinking about saying about Aggie's character? I, mm, if I'm forced to claim something, I have. Mm, I kind of have a couple of guesses because someone said Ekin claimed librarian. Someone said they'd heard of a washerwoman, and I don't think that was from anyone who spoke to Aggie, which means investigate a chef. But are they really all going to be in play? And the other one that would do that, well, the other two are soldier virgin. So I might gamble on one of those two and see what happens. Could always default to drunk, um, right? That is true, but also less fun. Um, and, you know, this is in the world where, yeah, in the world where I'm bluffing Undertaker as a fearmonger, what I want to happen is for us to execute someone and someone to argue against it, and then I can nominate the person who argued against it, because I'm going to be like, I saw them as the Baron, that person is evil, or whatever. Um, so that's why where I'm going with this. Um, the question is, I don't think, I'm just going to not nominate tomorrow. Um, so I'm inclined to... Ah, do I keep it on Ekin to add some paranoia, or do I move it now and hope that I can frame that person the night after? I don't think I can sell Aggie as being the fearmonger. Um, hmm. Sorry, I appreciate that this is taking a while. I'm just it's all right. doubting. Um, I think. Yeah, I think I'm going to stick with Ekin and not. Okay. Not nominate tomorrow. All right, thank you. Cheers. Hello, Wildstar. Hello. Who would you like to attack? Um, I'll attack the dean. The dean. Thank you. Okay, that's that's not good. Uh, so now Chris is going to get better empath info. Or he's going to get more empath info, should I say. Uh, Nikki's not dead, so we go straight to Chris. Hello, Chris. Hello. You awake and learn that zero of your living neighbours are evil. Oh, like the sound of that. Right, cheers. You. Hello again, Navian. Hello, hello. Who are you going to pick tonight? Well, we are going to keep with my strategy and choose Ekin and Ed next. Ekin and Ed, and you learn that no, neither of them is the demon. Thank you. So again, for the benefit of new players, um, Ed is on the evil team, but the fortune teller only detects the demon. And on this script, there's only one demon, it's the imp. Because while because Navian didn't pick the imp, uh, she gets a no regardless. And that is everything that we have to do tonight. Wake everyone up. You got the fear, F E A R. You got the fear, E A R. It's a great song. <laughs>
Okay, thanks, Nikki, for serenading us as everyone comes back. Uh, good morning, everyone. Nadine died in the night. Ooh. Chris and Nikki. Okay, chats. Yeah, we've got sure. Tavern, yeah. Uh, well, let's follow up. Chat. Yeah, let's do it. Bardic, we can finish our chat. Hello. How are we doing? Uh, what have you actually got as bluffs? Uh, Monk Slayer, Recluse, I'm claiming Slayer. Great, okay. Well, I may back out to a recluse then um or i might just crack on with the undertaker that i've been claiming cool um have you spoken to richie yet no uh, what are you I, i'm the fear monger he's the scarlet woman um he's been claiming that his role either starts or ends with an r so you might need to get that recluse bluff to him pretty quickly um yeah. although we might you may also mm, we may also be up shit creek because um Ekin is talking to him at the minute. Um, so, yeah. Uh, Ekin claimed librarian. Um, so if Ekin's seen another librarian and that someone said they'd already been a hard claim librarian, we need to probably get that claim out pretty fast if we want to sell a Baron game. But never mind. We'll see what happens with that. Right. Um, obviously, please vote for anyone I nominate. I'm probably not going to nominate today and let's see what happens. Yep. Good deal. All right. Who is it right um, now? Uh, it's still Ekin. We nearly won yesterday. Oh, awesome. we, we were that close yesterday. That's amazing. Um, I was hoping that was what it was. Yeah. Um, it was, yeah. So I deliberately didn't vote because I thought that me voting would scare people off. So I was like, let's see if this works right. anyway. Um, I, If I were you, I'd kill in the Chris, Evie, Nikki area because they have twice gone and had a group conversation, or tried to. Um, they tried to have a group yeah. conversation today, but one of them went off. Um, so I wouldn't be surprised if one, either Evie or Chris might be the empath. Um, uh, yeah, I'm role swapping with Evie the saint, but she's probably not the saint. Yeah, I would yeah, believe that. Okie dokie. Um, yeah, that's all I've got at the minute. Um, Navian claims not to wake up, so don't know about that at the minute. Might be, yeah, don't know for now. Um, yeah, like I say, I can claim librarian. So, yeah, have fun. Thanks. Oh, uh, I, might still, keep, I might still keep claiming Slayer for fun, but uh, okay. yeah. So for the sake of chat, um, so Nadine had claimed Slayer to me yesterday, so I asked her if she was still the Slayer. Uh, she said no. She asked me if I was still the Fortune Teller. I said no, because we're both very <laughs> truthful. <laughs> uh, I have told her that she is sat next to an empath who has had a zero on her and a zero again. She's told me that she's a Chef One. I've told her now that I'm the Raven Keeper and that somebody else has claimed Slayer. And that's why I checked about asking about the Slayer. Um, and I told her that there is actually a fortune teller out there who got a no on Wildstar and Richie. Did I miss anything? Did I tell you who the Slayer was? No, you've not. Would no. you like to? Yeah, fuck it, because unless it's you and Chris, um, I think you should be okay. Yeah, I, for all I know, I'm just like giving out the whole grim. <laughs> I'm, I'm not evil, Nikki, but I really wish I was, because you've been quite um, forthcoming here. <laughs> unless it's all wrong. I mean, this, this, this is. Evie told me that Wildstar is a Slayer, so. While stuck in the light and is trying to get herself killed, who knows? But yeah. Cool. Alrighty. Yeah. Yeah, a few more things in my grim then. Thank you. Bye. Bye. No, I've not spoken to Bardic. My circle is pretty blank, actually. I should uh, get around a bit more. Yeah, but... same. I'm still wondering if I was drunk. So I was hoping for an Undertaker, but none are coming. Mm, but... Yeah, maybe there isn't one. Oh well, which, ho I didn't which hopefully him. means no spy. Yeah, maybe. Or well, they just don't fancy going for the obvious bluff. <laughs> Being creative, I like <laughs> yeah, it. Yeah, they've gone for something creative. <laughs> sure. sure. Uh, right. Keep an eye out on Bardic because I was the virgin and he nominated me and didn't die. Oh, uh, you actually were. <sighs> yeah. Spice. Okay. Yeah, he could be a good kill then. Nice. All right. All right. Cool. Thanks, Chris. Thank you. See ya. I'm not gonna tell you, just just okay. for safety. Because <laughs> I I know sometimes with um.
pings. One is the true thing and the other is evil. So I'm just going right. to keep that to myself right yeah, now. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. Well, since, since I kind of bore my soul to you, will you tell me who you actually are? Yeah, I'm the Slayer. Okay. So I wouldn't mind knowing who the monk is if they're out there. That is true. I... Nah. I'll I'll see if I can continue rustling up things, but I'll I'll hold that info for now. Yep, sounds good. All right, thank you, Wildstar. Yep, thanks. What do you think about that, Wildstar? Perhaps I probably should have pivot, but I didn't. And like I knew it yesterday, she's the washerwoman who saw me as monk. Uh, and I should have pivot then. Oh well. Eh. <laughs> it's what it is. It is what it is. Share what information you've had? I have nose. Okay. So you've ruled now out. Now you tell me your role? Um. I lied, I'm the saint. <laughs> I'm just trying oh, to, interesting. I'm trying, I'm trying to get a night kill. Okay. <laughs> Happy to swap if you want. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That could work. That could work. Who am I clearing then? Um, I'm not will I'll let you make up the info and we will go we will come back to it if it's really relevant. Just say you have some nose out there like That's not particularly helpful. But okay. I mean, yeah. Okay. All right. Thanks for All right. All right. Cool. Thank you. Cool. I want to talk to chat quickly. <laughs> Interesting. I want to talk to chat quickly, Evie. <laughs> All right. All right. I'll leave you to it. Bye. <laughs> Bye. All right. Let me go back. Well. Hi, Ben. What do you think about that? I'm concerned. <laughs> Oh, beautiful. I'm concerned. <laughs> I like how she's all suspicious of you because you want to talk to chat. Yep. Yep. I'm okay with that. I would. I want her to be suspicious of me. <laughs> uh, I want evil players to be suspicious of me. And I think that Evie is evil right now. So. Okay. Good to know. Yep. All right. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Aggie has claimed virgin to me. Bard yeah, me too. Town, Bard claimed a townsfolk role, an uh, ongoing information role. So we need to know if he was a drunk that Ekin saw. Yes. Mm. Or if Aggie was poisoned. And if Aggie was poisoned, we're we'll looking at Wildstar, who's in a double claim. She's not in a double claim now. Oh, okay. Okay. Is she soldier? I don't know what she is, but. Oh, okay. I know that the other half of the double claim isn't. Uh, fair enough. Okay. I'll just call Ekin in for a sec. Yeah, we need. Oh, to we shan't a wild star. I don't know if there's um, anyone heard of who the other librarian is. No, I thought maybe Ed. Based on things that were said, he was like happy to die and stuff. Although he, no, I don't know who the librarian is. Why would you double claim as a, li a librarian? Then they've apparently confirmed an outsider. Both of them confirmed outside. Okay, oh, uh, who, who did you Who check? were the drunks you saw? Uh, it's Linksel and Nikki. Okay, cool. So not the person we think might okay. be drunk. Linksel or Nikki. Okay. So wait, another. So Ed said that he heard of a librarian who confirmed a non drunk. But, mm, I'd probably kill Navian. Welcome back, everyone. Welcome Hi, back. Navian. Oh. Um, Welcome Can back, we... everyone, except for yeah. Navian. Oh, me trying to drag Claim Navian. Cool. Welcome back, everyone. Uh, take a minute or two to chat, then we'll open nominations. It didn't want to drag me back to town. I got stuck. So, I have who's been... the second librarian? Yeah, they should come up. I have the local. From what I, from what I understand, I think it's one librarian, and they told different things to different people. Well, Ed explicitly said he heard of a librarian who confirmed a non-drunk. I didn't say they confirmed a non-drunk. They said it was a non-drunk. Um, that's what I've got. And who was that, Ed? Yeah. Uh, well, Ekin's being quite blunt about being a librarian in this situation. Ekin's saying that he saw a drunk. 
Okay. So, so sorry. So Ekin is the only librarian everyone anyone's heard of this game. Ekin, were you just it? lying to me about not seeing a drunk? Is that what's going on here? Yep. Right. Okay. <laughs> 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 So you, you told you told me the truth, and other people lies. Uh, apparently, I just lied to. Him. So the librarian double claim just... was Ekin and, and himself. Did, did two <laughs> did, we, did we not get a new fear Mor fear monger pick? We, we, did, we did not. Did not. Yes, yeah, on the same person. Okay. I have heard okay. of another double claim though. Uh, uh, oh. Which one? Before the we go to. Okay. Sorry. Before we go into that too much, uh, Aggie, you, do you want to say anything? Did I? I don't yeah, know, it's up to you. Should. I, 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 I think you should come out. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm the virgin, Bardic nominated me and didn't die. Poof. Nikki nominated oh. Bardic. Interesting. Wait, wait, wait. Nomination's oh. not yet open, Nikki, you eager beaver. Can, can I nominate uh, okay. Bardic? No, no, no one no, is no. nominating Bardic until I say so. Wait, Nikki, okay. can I nominate no, no, Bardic instead? Nikki nominate Bardic! Aggie's dead. <laughs> can we have more discussion, please? Yeah. Uh, fun okay. okay. Who do you fun, want to nominate Bardic? Uh, fun fact: I'm an outsider. Can, what, Bardic what, uh, in? Then you don't mind dying. Then you don't uh, mind dying. I very much do mind dying. Actually, interesting. Uh, Aiming uh, are you? I am uh, the saint. Sounds like uh, it. So, I, I, Navian, sorry, but. It's fine. It was good while it lasted, which was so all the Navy day. So Navy and I talked first chat, and I was like, "All right, hard, I hard claimed Saint. They hard claimed a role. We swapped." Uh, Ekid, did you? Ekid, have you lied to everyone you've spoken to so far? No, I told. Um, I think Rick the truth. Now yeah, who? nominations are open. You told me the truth. Yeah. R Richie yeah. nominates Bardic. Oh Richie, tell us why you've nominated Bardic. Uh, wanted to get in there before Nikki. Um, <laughs> like, just don't. I don't want this to be led by over eager fearmongers. Uh, Bardic. Uh, Bardic is claiming a role which. He's claiming Saint by the sound of things. But Correct. I am under the impression that he is specifically not the Saint. Um, so I've got a librarian who's changing their story. So I'm a bit lost at this point. Okay, Bardic. Um, I don't believe the librarian's changing their story other than what they've said. That is not me. I am the saint. Uh, day one, talk one, I talked with Navian, and they, they and I uh, roll swapped uh, me into a townsfolk, them into a uh, outsider. And so when I nominated Aggie and nothing happened, I went shrug. Okay, cool. And then I uh, continued on with my merry way, not thinking anything of it. When now that Aggie comes out as the virgin, I go, oh, okay. That makes a lot more sense since I am not a townsfolk. So, um, EV, I will neither confirm nor deny that. Uh, but I can't, Navian can confirm that I did do a role swap with them, uh, and that I have been, uh, going on with that the entire time. Also, I have heard of a double claim straight to my face of my own role, and I would like to push on them after this. Okay. Five votes required. Oh, Ekin. Mm. Oh no. Wait, what? <laughs> What's going on? Link's a you, lie. You didn't call this, Richie. Yeah, but, but the people who are voting are the wrong people. Nikki nominates Nikki. Nikki, oh, no. tell us why you've nominated Nikki. Well, first of all, you know this can't be a fear mongrel nomination, because otherwise I would lose, and I don't want to do that. I like winning. Second of all, um, I think this would be really good information um, for an Undertaker um, for reasons. Um, third of all, other than Saint, has anybody heard of any named outsider? No. Uh, by, a, by a librarian? No, not by, by a librarian, not, not a drunk, okay? And somebody knowing for a fact that they are an outsider. I've uh, heard yeah. a one for t one in two, and the other. Role... I don't like those. I just like hard claimed outsiders. I can't. Well, have... outsiders may not do that when they want to die at night, Nikki. That's a thing. Yeah, but somebody can be like, I've heard of one, and they are one, you know. Yeah, but when but... you flag it like that, they're not gonna, are they? <laughs> okay, cool. Anyway, execute this. Do you want to do this first? Yes, we do this. All right. He's happy with it. 
All right, we'll Why get some more information. There I understand where Nikki is coming from. It is not possibly the best skill, but I want to get it, it on the block. To five, I'll be impressed. Five Damn. is enough, and Richie is impressed. Any other nominations? <laughs> <laughs> I'm very good at impressing people. Uh, Nikki, if you're good and falling on your sword, we can have words after this game. I have reasons. Um, well, he's he's not evil people, and falling on his sword. <laughs> other people might get information. If he's evil and falling on his sword, it could be a good legitimate play. It's doubtful, Maybe. but it could be. Second call. If he's good. <laughs> mm. Zero panic. I mean, uh, yeah, Aggie, there's that makes zero sense. Panic. What you just said in chat. I don't blame you at all for that. So well, of course there's zero panic. I'm I'm a good um, person who wants him to die in a sword. But I think Final I thought call. you were gonna um, follow up with the Saint double claim. I'm sorry, I can what? You were gonna follow up with the Saint double claim I thought today? Yeah. Oh, I'll, yeah, do okay. I'll do it tomorrow. Nikki is executing. I'll do it tomorrow. The game continues. Everybody it's goes well, to sleep. Well, Oh, that's a, a that is a real waste of a of a Raven Keeper in my opinion. Why is Nadine not being dragged into the channel? Weird. Yeah, there's a real waste of, of a Raven Keeper. Uh, I don't think they had any suspicions that he was the Raven Keeper. Uh, I don't believe he told anyone. I feel like he could have he could have ridden that one out really. Um, but hey ho, let's go see if Ed wants to choose a new player. Hello, Ed. Hello. Do you want to choose a new player? I don't know. Um, I don't feel like I have a solid lead. I feel like the Saint double claim is coming from somewhere down in the Navian Chris EV situation, but Navian's an authorized double claim, so it can't be Navian. Which makes me think Chris EV, and they are trusting each other. That's twice that they've those two and Nikki have jumped off. Uh, happily, Nikki claimed to me, um, so this might might either completely screw or really help my Undertaker bluff. Um, ah, I don't think I can nominate Ekin again and get away with it. I gonna have to push you, Ed. Yeah, I'll uh, fuck it. I can play this as evil for longer and stick with. Yeah, actually no, I'll change to Linksal. Links or okay. Yeah. All right. Welcome back to the town square, everyone. It is my immense pleasure to announce to you that the fearmonger has chosen a new player. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> 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 okay, uh, that won't stop. Hello, who would you like to attack tonight? Oh my god. So, either Chris or Evie is the empath, and being wrong is not great. Because they are next to each other. Mm. Clock Tower is hard. <laughs> I'm gonna kill Evie. Okay, Evie it is, thank you. Alright, this is good, because... Uh... Evie as the mayor, uh, we can have that kill bounce off onto someone else. And I believe that Navian, if she's going around the circle, her next choice is going to be someone in Wildstar. So I'm actually going to have that ping off onto Navian to protect Evil, who I think are struggling, to be honest. Um, they've not taken the bait that I've given them for uh, for the drunk washerwoman, so that's going to come up sooner or later. Um, <clears throat> yeah, and I think... I think at this point we kind of have to throw them a bone. Uh, useful info for the empath, for sure, but that's just a, a Scarlet Woman. So I think I think everyone gets something out of that.
Uh, so we go to Chris. <clears throat> hello, Chris. Oh, I live. Yes, you do. And you wake and you learn a one. <gasps> a one. Cool. Love. Oh, I've cut him off. Never mind. <clears throat> At the end of the day, um, now that Richie's probably going to be executed for being evil, that means that Wildstar can pass to Ed, who has so far been a successful Undertaker bluff, which is pretty big. I would say. Don't fear the reaper. <laughs> you just get the one mine this time. <laughs> I love that song. I'm, a, I'm actually a re I'm a really big Blue Oyster Cult fan. <laughs> like a, a, one of my favourite bands. So I was quite happy for nice. with that. Um, anyway, uh, Navian died in the night. Well, there you go, Richie. That that solves that for you. Okay, well done. Fair enough. Um, um, Evie, can we talk? Navy, and you want to talk? Uh, uh, yeah, I can. Let's go. It'll be quick. Uh, Nikki, chat. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Hey, so, why is this group of four of us? Well, is I know Aggie, but Evie, Chris. Oh, so I am the empath. Um, okay. I've zero on Evie Nadine, a zero on Evie Navian, and a one on Evie Richie. He's evil. <gasps> Richie, evil. He's evil. Yeah, <laughs> I noticed he nominated the saint yesterday as well, which is great. Wow. And um, he... What, yeah, what, he what was... were you, Nadine? Sorry to interrupt you there, Evie. Uh, um, I've been going around saying Slayer, but it's actually just a chef with a one, so it's cool. Thank you. A chef with a one, nice. Chef one, oh. though, if you're thinking... Mm. Yeah, but we can keep claiming that Nadine was an important role, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah just put it in chat to yeah. make it look like it stabilizes if they think it's... And that's what, that's okay. why I added what I added. So this whole um, Saint double claim thing, um, that's me. I'm gonna be switch. Um, I, I only claim Saint to try and hide my real role. Um, hey, I'm, okay to I'm okay to out to you guys. Um, I'm actually the mayor and I'm gonna switch to Slayer. <gasps> wow, okay. Appa wait, wait, apparently Wildstar is a Slayer. Apparently yeah, she's retracted that, that claim. I've heard that she's retracted it. Oh. oh. I heard it through Yeah, someone. so I, I think we we thought Nadine and Wildstar were a Slayer double claim, but it sounds like she's Yeah, yeah, that's what happened. So Nikki got Slayer for both of us and then it came to me and I was like, no, I was just saying that. And apparently... Oh, it was Nikki saying it was Nadine that retracted, not, not yeah, Wildstar. Yeah, possibly. I don't know about Wildstar, but... Yeah, because Wildstar hard claimed Slayer to me day one and I hard claimed the Saint to her and I said to her um, that we could do a role swap. Okay. Um, yeah. If there is a chef one, though... So I think it's probably Richie. Richie, yeah, good. Richie Ekin. And then it's... Well, or it's Richie, Ekin's good, and it's two of either Ed Linksall or Ed Wildstar. Oh, Richie spoke with Linksall uh, straight away on day one, so I, I'm yep. happy to believe that... Um... Richie, Linksall, Ed? Possibly. Yeah. Ed and Richie also spoke on <laughs> day one as well. Oh, there you go. Oh, no, I was meant to be good <laughs> in this. I'm not sure about you Ed, know what, yeah. Anyone know what Ed and Linksall are claiming? Nope. 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 I know what they're disclaiming and I don't like it. What's oh, it day. Oh. Do you want to share? I'm sure I can figure it out. Another saint? Undertaker? Yeah. Oh, okay. spicy. Did he call, call your virginness? Yeah. Virginity? No. Uh, yes. So Ed... Yes, he verified my virginity. Thank you, Nadine. Hi. <laughs> Ed a spy Fine doesn't go great with the chef one. No, the chef no. no. Oh, unless, sorry, unless it is actually Richie Ekin as the chef one. Link's all good. And Ed on his own. I'm reading Ekin is good, though, but that could be wrong. Yeah. I don't like either of those. I want Ed to be good. You want Ed, Ed to be good. <laughs> we all want Ed to be good, but we got to sometimes. If play Ed. Back. If that is the spy, I've lived a long time as an empath, and I've gained a lot of yeah. seemingly useful info. I mean, like no, most, if you're just, if you're just I've charming confirmed. us, Chris, with your no, angelic voice, I'm this not is just unfair. You. Yeah, yeah, I'm just saying, why, why, why is... Yeah, Chris... Wait, There's nothing confirming me, I'll admit oh, that. Okay, um, fine. Well, I hard, I hard claimed at the start of day one to Evie and Nikki, 
Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, did you all actually claim your real roles? Yeah, we did all claim yeah. Your roles. Wow. Wait, Chris doesn't do that on day one. This was the redemption arc. Yes, the that redemption. was the witness. <laughs> and to be fair, I had a zero on EV, so there's at least one good player in my in my combo. Exactly. So wait, wait, wait. With the with the fearmonger, there's less likely to be a sprite, right? Because there's only one other minion. Yes, be that's true. Baron. We don't think it's Baron, right? Based on the outside, no one's coming up. It's Thanks for, thanks for Richie chatting again. <laughs> oh, <laughs> your attention. Yes. So be, I'd be wary of any nominations coming from the left hand side of the circle. Uh, can, can, can we get you, you, you lot to nominate on this side? Yeah. Uh, Hello. Hi, Nikki. Hello. 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 I did have a reason for that. I'm not going to say that reason to everybody in here though. Demon candidates would be either you or Bardic. So I suspect that huh. maybe the empath info is not correct. You know, that's fair. Yeah, so em empath could be the drunk. I actually don't know who the drunk pings are. I have just confirmed with Ekin that it is not me, though. I mean, there's also the alternative mm -hmm. that Ekin is maybe a spy who's claiming librarian and is lying about where the drunk actually is. And I could be the drunk. Yeah, yeah that's true. Um, who so knows? But based off of my information, I mean, you can you can obviously do whatever you feel is right with your ability, but that's just what my information tells you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna... Uh, I mean, I don't suppose you want to tell me who that empath is so I can shoot them. Yeah, it's Chris. Oh, nice. Uh, so the strong options are Chris and Bardock. And yeah, I, but if so, if Chris is good and he's just the drunk, then you also have Evie as an option. Um, if true. Chris is evil, then you still also have Evie as an option because he could be an empath trying to quote unquote clear uh, somebody else who is also yeah. evil. So basically, I have the right half of the circle as an option, and we're back where we started. <laughs> basically, um, if if Richie's evil, I suspect he's a minion. I, I wouldn't be surprised mm -hmm. if Richie was actually the fearmonger, to be honest. Yeah, that's fair. He gave me that he was a, a townsfolk that starts or ends with an R. That yep, that same. Mm -hmm. And then I was like, great, so I'm going to mark you down as a potential fearmonger because that also ends with an R True. and you're sort of not lying. We had a fun conversation where we were like, and great, so characters if, if that start with S and actually <laughs> specify that that included Scarlet Woman and Spy. Having trouble seeing my monk. <laughs> um, yeah, to be fair, I mean, a monk potentially does want to hide um, mm -hmm. and didn't get the vibes that you were claiming Washer Woman, but yeah, fair enough. Alrighty. Um, I'm assuming none of your monk pings are dead. No. Okay, fair enough. Alrighty then. All right. I will leave you to it. See you bit. Sounds good. Thanks, Ed. Hi, chat. It's the first game Hello. ever, and I'm super nervous. <laughs> but I'm <laughs> I'm having fun. Have you have have neither of your pings come out to you as monk yet? Then. Not really. I have a hunch who it is, but. Nobody's really overtly said, oh, thank goodness, you're the washerwoman and you found me. <laughs> <laughs> That's very um, delicious. Well, I, uh, yeah, I wish you all the luck. Thank you very much. Welcome. Be right there. So. Oh, they're hey, asking. Chad, Hello. Why do they want me to join? I just got here. Uh, <laughs> hi, chat. Uh, I just want to put this out into the ether right now. It's possible that Linksel is the fearmonger and chose me, and then once I came out of Saint and knows I'm not going to get executed, switched it last night. I just want to put that into the ether right now, just in case I'm right. Yeah, All we've right. been comparing notes, Chad, so um, yep. if you want to go talk to... Uh, I will. See what happens. I'll go talk to the duo. Let me know how it goes. This is interesting. <laughs> I like fearmonger. <laughs> right. Thanks, Ben. Look. Mm. Monk. Oh. Washerwoman confirmed. It makes me distrust Ekin. Or at least. Who's, distrust who's your washerwoman? Uh. Why do I trust you? I mean, I am the guy who got himself executed, and the fearmonger very clearly had picked me. Um, and. If you're the uh, spy, though, that's a great way to get trust and lead kills. But, uh, it's. But well, then, in which case, I would know who the washerwoman fine, is. Fine, fine, fine. It's Linksaw. It's Linksaw. Yeah, make a good point. 
Oh, okay, she cool. She came washing to me, and she, when she first did it, fished okay. for information. She didn't hardly come out and say it, and I just gave her bullshit information. She then fished for it again, and it makes sense. Because apparently Ekin saw Linksall or Bardic as either the recluse or the drunk. But now that Bardic is coming out as the saint, I, I, it feels like I've either misheard or the um. information is changing. And I trust Linksall because she's she basically told, I basically said, okay, I'm not the roles I gave. I'm either the monk, this or that. And she said, you're the monk. And I was like, okay, now, now I trust you. Okay. And cool. so far I've picked Chris and Evie. I might start picking Wildstar. Then, though. Yeah. Hmm. Welcome back, everyone. Uh, take a couple minutes, then we'll open nominations. Um. Okay. Uh, ben, you might be muted. Oh, ben okay. is muted. I am muted. <laughs> Hello. Yes. Take a couple Hello. minutes. Hello. All right. So there's two very weird worlds that we're living in right now. One of it includes four people the other includes other four people right <laughs> and i'm it worried too about off the teams oh, <laughs> so uh navy do you want to share your info at all um not at this moment i think if okay. i keep quiet uh i think at this point probably everybody has figured out that i am the fortune teller uh it makes sense that i died after you had to out our role swap because i assume that anybody you claimed to would then be able to surmise that i'm the fortune teller so uh, i won't be giving out my pings um because I don't want to tell the demon who is safe or not safe to kill uh i think if some of my pings yeses or nos are alive at uh towards the end of the game i can narrow down worldviews with that info yep um with that being said um uh where do i want to take this so i and you know I i'm hearing i i don't see a reason to necessarily okay. Bardic, based on the mutterings I'm hearing, I'm being told that there's accusations of me being in a Chef 1, and I'm interested as to if there's any information that points to that other than a Chef 1, or is it just people are looking for places that there's a Chef 1? There might be an investigator as well. Cool. Where's this invest I've got claims from everyone now. Investigators should out, like, early. Nominations mm -hmm. are open. Can somebody chef, nominate chef Akin? They can nominate Akin. Uh, sorry, was that Akin nominate second? Akin nominate second. All right, tell us why. I don't want to give the fear monger the chance to nominate me if I'm, I am the fear monger picked. It would be good to get an undertaker check on me, maybe. <coughs> I'm happy to die. I have been claiming library, but um, yeah. Okay, four votes required. We don't want to kill Akin here, guys. Um, Linksall, uh, have you lied to me, by the way? Maybe. <laughs> okay, cool. No, no, it's good. I've been told something else about you, and that's why I wanted Once, to... not enough. Um... There's a consensus that Richie might be a better kill here. I disagree with mm. that as well. I... Really? Am... Yeah. I'm going off of... Evie and Chris are on the I, I almost want to go off of the non fortune teller pings right now is there a fortune teller that. ping on either chris or evie because if so i'd like one of them executed agreed i would like chris uh, or evie uh, would anybody be would people be okay with me nominating and not squirreling out <laughs> i'm uh, kind that? of like the, I'm the only yes, Bardic, outsider I'm right now to nominate. yeah then uh bardic nominates chris all right tell us why there is not in any fortune teller info on Chris right now. Uh, they, uh, Chris and Evie have been conspiring a long time so far uh, with a bunch of stuff. They could easily be a chef one, yeah, at least in the possible worlds. Uh, we don't really know anything about them, and I think we need to kill non-fortune teller pings at the moment. Um, and we should get at least something on the block. This is a good kill. Chris. Um, I will say me and Evie both hard claimed to Nikki on day one independently in a chat. Like, admittedly, one of us, I guess, could be the demon who'd have the bluff. The other minion would have to be complete cold cool. Um, me and Evie are not evil. Um, I think all three evils are alive and on the opposite end of the circle to us. Um, this is a really bad kill. Um, but I guess you want to vote for it? Can't stop you. 
Chris, can I add to that for you? Yeah, you can. Yeah, I mean, it's against you, but that, that hard oh. claim, uh, the three of us, um, I believe, I was like, we should do a hard claim of three, two, one, and everybody says it at the same time. And then I said mine, Evie said hers, and then you said yours. Like, there was a bit of a delay. Uh, it wasn't a three, two, one at the same time, like we had tried to agree. Just want to say. Sorry, Chris. Oh, even, even then, it's still like picking a roll out of 12. Like, you eliminating one roll for us isn't going to save a double claim. Like, it's not statistically significant. Four required. Richie, I would ask that you please vote on this. <laughs> Why? Uh, because uh, because I feel you. like the evil team right now is Chris, Lynx, or Ed. Uh, Interesting. Link's Interesting. Link's um, okay. Interesting. I'm happy with this assumption. No, <laughs> is enough. Richie, did you just claim that Lynx was good? Or the spy, at which point she's not the demon. Great. Well, mm. we want to uh, again. I'm going off of non-demon pings, and right now with Link you... and Ed both not voting on that, that was super like. Okay. Vote. Yeah. Wait, wait, Ed wait. dominates Link Soul. Uh, oh. I feel like Link Soul should All right. probably out. Ed, tell us why you've nominated Link Soul. Um, I know I'm not evil. I'm looking for a Chef One. I have reasons to trust a few people, which eliminates a lot of worlds of Chef One. If we're not going to execute Chris or Evie, which I think it. Bardic, regardless of whether I do this nomination, there are going to be nominations, and there's enough people who believe Evie and Chris at the moment that they're going to get four, so we might as well execute someone when we have control over it. Um, I think... I'm hearing reasons that Richie is sus. Um, he's also been dodgy as hell in the conversation with me. Uh, days one and three, I think. Um, so I would like to kill Linksall, because he's vouching for Linksall. Link Soul, your um, response. I was gonna nominate myself. And now I feel more much more uncomfortable. I, I was literally like trying to say it right as Ed was saying it, I promise. Um I feel a little less comfortable about that. I'm willing to nominate myself tomorrow if everybody still doesn't trust me. I don't mind dying, but I'm just afraid of fearmonger stuff. Okay. Five to execute. Links is, Links is mechanically good here. Can She's I, not, can I so say no, this is no, potentially... Don't, don't vote for this, whatever you do. Wait, this why is, is potentially why is Ed as Fearmonger nominating the spy to <laughs> get a win oh. here. Yeah. Oh, there's, there's no way, there's no way Ben gives the Fearmonger a win on a spy. That is like... Yeah, yeah. I wouldn't. Why, why wouldn't you have the minion power help? Of course because, we could Because the good team don't get to play the game at that point. That's not yeah. fun or interesting. Yeah, it's I mean, just it's a, a cheese. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> it's just not fun. <laughs> okay, so when Chris dies and the game doesn't end, then can we listen to the Evie and Chris pair, please? Who, who nominated uh, Chris, by the way? Uh, uh, Bardic did. Final call. If I could get, if I could get Evie, why do you trust Chris? Evie or Chris? Um, I, I don't know. Evie is quite reluctant at mostly reading me. Dies. The game continues, of course. Everyone goes to sleep. Okay. Uh, again, I think I think I think Ed's kind of shown his hand a little bit now. I think it's I think it's someone so I think it's somewhat obvious uh, that he's the fearmonger, but uh, who knows? He might be able to bring it round. Hello again. Hello. <coughs> Looks like you might be getting rumbled there, Ed. Uh, I kind of went with a different world partway through today because they actively think I'm the fearmonger, so I'm trying to push that and see if I can survive long enough to catch a star pass because that'll be hilarious. Um, <laughs> if they're so sure I'm the fearmonger, I'm just going to keep pushing nominations every day and see if they kill me. Because if they kill me, great. They're not killing Wildstar or Richie. If they don't kill me, then they're going to be killing Wildstar or Richie and I'm, I might catch a star pass and what could go wrong? So for the benefit uh, it, of the new guys in chat, catching a star pass is a slang term that we use uh, which refers to when the imp kills themselves in the night and a minion becomes the new imp. Uh, it's something that only the imp can do. Uh, and yeah, yeah, there it is. Thank you. Thank you, Tyron. Um, but I... I think I'm going to stick with Lynx so that there's no more, no other ping. Okay, thank you. 
Okie dokie. Okay, Wildstar, who's it gonna be? Ekin. Ekin, thank you. Interesting choice, because of course Wildstar knows that Ekin is not gonna get any increasing information, but uh, I'm pretty sure that's just because um, Eevee looks so suspicious and so does Bardic that it's better to keep them alive. Um, and that is everything for tonight. Just kill a little bit of time because, uh, you know, Ed is bluffing Undertaker, I think. She does know Eevee is mayor, that's true, yeah. Um, right, yeah, let's, let's wake these guys up. When you think it all become clear Cause I'm being taken over by the fear Thanks, Nicky. Really <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> um, Ekin died in the night. There are six players alive. Okay, um, okay. Aggie, can we have a chat? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Tell yeah, me. Can we have a chat, please? Sure. I want to talk to Nikki. Why'd you go so far down? Uh, just because. I'm lazy, okay? Well, I don't like scrolling. Right, what do you see? I saw Empath. Oh, damn it. There goes that world. Vanessa's a poisoner. That's <sighs> the problem, is that it really could just be Poisoner Fearmonger. And that's that's that. Um, yeah. If I'm honest. I'm if... struggling to piece together where a Chef One could fit in. Hmm. Uh, there's options depending on what Eevee actually is, but yeah. No. Okay. She's not a recluse, if that's what you're trying no, to say. No, that's not what I'm thinking. Um, I'm looking at night deaths. What, a chef, fortune teller, librarian? Yeah, exactly. Um... You think someone's trying to hide a spy game? No, I'm wondering... I've heard rumours of a mayor. The only person who can be a mayor is Evie. If Evie's actually the mayor, then you can have a chef one either side of Richie and one of them was a mayor bounce. Yeah. Um, so the question is, where is the chef one then? Uh, if Evie's not the mayor, then... Okay, e e e Evie's the mayor, because you, you're either the Undertaker or the Spy. I can't be bothered mm -hmm. to piss around. So, cool. yes, Evie is the mayor, but where is this Chef One p fitting in? Well, the thing is, from my point... Well, I mean, it, the easiest place is probably Ekin Star Passing, but if you guys don't believe that, then fine. Um, I'd be interested to know who his other drunk ping was, because... So, his drunk pings were me and Lix Linksel. Linksel's claiming Washerwoman, um, who saw Richie as the monk. Okay, is Richie actually claiming monk? Richie is claiming monk. Okay, so Linksel either... had been claiming monk to me for a right. couple of days before Richie cleared it up, okay? Right. And she said that she was going to protect you. I told her to protect you. Right. So, if, if they are an evil pair together... Then they would have killed you at some point and been, well, oops, it's the washerwoman who you've been telling to protect Ed, not the monk. Yeah? Um, I'm not sure that's true because this way around they can interchangeable the bluff if they need it. Yeah. But because, you know, that's pretty standard for evil teams to not want to kill the person they're claiming to be monk protecting. Um. But then, even still, yeah, if it's Linksel Ooh. and Richie, where's the Chef One fit in? Mm, good question. Chef could just be the drunk, and Ekin was poisoned because they're next to they're in between two evil players. Yeah, the one thing which I don't like mm -hmm. is why is um, Navy not saying their fortune teller pings at all? Not even their yes pings. Doesn't help. Also, this fucking hell, this chat in the apothecarium. Do they not realise they're making Wait. themselves just look worse and worse the bigger that chat is? Okay, fair enough. 
Well, we can run with that. And how many of them are alive? Bardic, Eevee, Wildstar. Okay, three out of six are alive. Interesting. Interesting. Weird. Um, okay. Also, I love the fact that Eevee's like, we all trust Aggie. Like, as far as I'm aware, the only reason to trust Aggie is my information. <laughs> so, she could lol. be spy. She could, I mean, she could be, yeah, she could be literally anything. Ed doesn't die to the shooting. We need to execute Ed for sure to get rid of the chef one situation. So we definitely yeah. need to execute Ed. Ed for so shoot, 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 what are you? Shoot, Ed. Ed. shoot Richie, execute Ed. So Evie, what, what are, are the, you? I'm the, I'm the mayor. Everyone knows at this point. Okay. Um. Also, I feel like whilst I should not survive much longer, so I feel like we yeah. I am. Yeah. Um, yeah. So we're we're, we're saying that Linksoul is the spy, Ed is the fearmonger, fear and Richie is the demon. Is that kind of the world I, we're living in currently? Yes. It's or, a like, view. Or, or, it, it's or, a view that Richie, technically Richie works, other than other than Navian's <coughs> no on Richie night one. But if Navian is if Navian is the drunk and Ekin pinged off the spy, Linksel, then that Okay, crap. okay, what if uh, I and I and I guess that would make sense Ekin because there's poison. almost no there's no poisoning in this yeah, script. There's no poisoning. If there's if but why wouldn't a D die first? Yeah, that's why I still don't I still don't think it's spy. I think it's um... It could be a it could have been a mayor bounce. Like... If there's no spy and it's a poisoner, and that's how Ekin got wrong info. And also everything else is broken. Or well, if there's a poisoner, then Navian's info is completely unreliable, and then we really don't have anything to. Go. Exactly. Yeah. If um, it's poisoner, fear monger. Then, yeah. then, then confirming the mayor might be helpful. So I would suggest shooting Evie, but it's your shot too. I I, I would also think. like to be <laughs> like to shoot Evie, but. I mean, um, you only have my, you only have the reads from Nikki and Chris. Welcome back, everyone. Uh, take a minute, and then we'll open nominations. Um, I will tell everyone that now. I am the Slayer. I am going to use my shot today. And whilst I, I just, am taking bids from the town as to who to do that. Just to add, while Star, like, the thing that you guys talked about at the end of the chat, there's no point confirming them if they may not be around at the end of the game. Yeah. Whichever, whoever's the Slayer, I just double-check Bardic, although it's just been no, mentioned that no, he's no, the no, only no, person who's claiming it? Outsider. Bardic is the only outsider. Okay. Unless there's a recluse in hiding thinking Bardic is his other outsider, Bardic is mechanically good. Um, yep. Which is probably why I, I think, which makes sense. I need to shoot Richie Execute Ed. Yeah, I'll yep. say, say Wildstar. Um, I've no, been I, an I, I want, I want Link been... Team or myself to nominate mm, Wildstar the... and Wildstar to shoot. I, I, Evie or Ed, to be fair. Shouldn't I be the one nominating no, no, whoever Bardic we're going to execute? Yeah. 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 Yeah, let's let Okay, so um, based on my fortune teller info, uh, Evie is a decent shot. I agree with that. But yeah. that's only going off of Navian's fortune teller info. Like, yeah, that's the there is only... other info that contradicts it. And the reality is that if both of our info is screwy, then probably one of us is evil. Because if Ekin pinged off of a spy to get that drunk ping, only one of us could be the drunk. And my information is potentially in conflict with somebody else's. It's not entirely in conflict, though. So, Navian, um, I have heard of an Undertaker, a fortune teller, and an empath. I don't believe that all three are good or sober. So I the, agree with one that. One of yes. the worlds we have is that Ekin pinged off the spy. You are the actual drunk. That um, is you know, as absolutely a potential open. world, yes. You know, I've, I've decided. Richie, Richie nominates Wildstar. Richie, tell us why you've chosen Wildstar. Um, sorry, Bardic can Bardic nominate Wildstar? Nope, you've nominated really? Wildstar. Tell us all about oh, it. Oh, the stupid role. Um, basically, I think Wildstar, she's come out publicly. I was going to kind of press for this regardless, because I think it's already public from what I've heard from other people. If she shoots either Ed or Evie, I think Evie, if we are to believe this fortune teller, especially as Evie's trying to suggest the fortune teller is drunk, thus clearing herself, and we kill Wildstar, we've basically got a 50-50 chance to end the game today. Okay, Wildstar. Like Wildstar's having some connection problems. Richie, can you ask your info? I don't know what you're actually claiming. I've been confirmed by Washwoman. 
uh, that washerwoman is also claiming. Can you hear as well, Star? All right, I'm afraid the show must go on. Uh, so votes for Wildstar. Three required. I, I don't know she think it's it. the right nomination. It I know she is. I know, I know she didn't no. get a... Oh, that's just that's frustrating. It's uh, fine. Maybe I You're just off. want to add that in enough. the world that we have, three evils are alive right now. If you think I'm... <laughs> Evil, you guys can execute me if the game doesn't. I think up. we should execute I, it too I, today. I, I, I would I like to hear Wildstar shot. <laughs> yes, hello, I'm back. Um, we you haven't done any today, nominations, so you know. Yes, you've been nominated. You have not been. You have not been put on the block. Okay, awesome. Thank you. Uh, I will shoot Richie. Okay, Wildstar shoots Richie and misses. There is Why? No that was yep, clearly a wrong shot. Why? Who yeah, are who? I still think who? we should execute Richie. Oh, Jesus. No. I think we've potentially got a drunk chef. Because chef who the one fuck is, the chef? is just not fitting in. Um, Ed, Ed and one of the people next to it. it. It fits with with a couple Bardic of nominates Ed. Bardic, no. Tell us why you've chosen Ed. We have to kill someone. We need to break up these worlds. I think that Ed is a good choice in all of all of these uh, scenarios. Sadly, I'm still not trusting Avivi, but uh, we need to push on someone. And right now, Town's kind of leaning this way. So. Ed. Interesting. Cool. Um, yeah, I, I hear that there's people thinking that I must be evil purely based on nothing other than a Chef One. Um, also, in the world where Navian has been saying that their fortune teller information points to one of two people, I'd think that if I was one of them, Navian would have pushed on this harder, so clearly I'm not, so this seems a bit pointless. Um, most people know, I think almost everyone knows, that I'm the Undertaker. I'm either the Undertaker or the Spy. Uh, if you want to use an execution on me, it's a massive waste. Uh, especially in the world where the world that people are selling, where I'm evil, it has all three evils alive, so I can't have caught a star pass. What's the point? Okay. Three required. Yeah, I agree. This is a bad... Mm. Ed Don't worry, the evil Ed team are going for it anyway. Uh, Linksy, can you take your hand out? I think this... So, which is yeah. evil. So, no, which is evil. No, which is evil. I'm not evil. No, Look at the vote. Evil. Look at the vote. Look at the vote. That's not Four me is being enough. evil. Should Someone's evil. Linksy, can you That's nominate great. Evie, please? Um, I don't understand how I could be evil. Like, in what world? Like, there's actual basically... information, actual mechanical info. It's it's mechanical evil. information. Yeah, there's yeah. mechanical information backing me up. Thank you very much. Like, like uh, so, in the world where there's mechanical information pointing at Richie, you're executing me. Great, thanks. You're right. That's there's what mechanical information it's pointing at Richie, Richie being evil, but, yeah, but specifically I was the wrong... not the demon. Yes. Why? Okay. Why? People insinuating I'm a minion. There was a better Slayer shot, which is the fortune teller ping. And we didn't loudly shout to the alleged Slayer to shoot Eevee, which I, I, think, tried. I think is the alleged fortune teller ping, but I'm not sure because that's Final not been call. confirmed to me. It's all been alleged. Lynx, can you please nominate Eevee? There's no fortune teller ping on you. I would is love for somebody to nominate Richie. There isn't. Oh, there, okay. there's, a, there's a not fortune teller. Ed is executed and dies. Great. The game there continues. Everyone goes to sleep. Uh, oh! <laughs> Ed sounds so annoyed. I don't know if he's faking it or not. I imagine he probably is a little bit annoyed because his argument was quite quite good, to be fair. <laughs> Alright, but sadly, guys, we're not going to see a fearmonger death. But that just means you should tune in on Sunday for the US stream, where you might see one. Okay, Wildstar, who's it going to be? You hear me? Oh no, not again. Send her a message. <clears throat> Mardic, okay. Oh dear. Well, it looks like Wildstar is having some audio issues, which is a shame, because she's the demon. <laughs> but, uh, hey-ho. Alright, we're gonna wake up with four alive. 
Um, and two of them are going to be evil. This should be interesting. Uh, I'm aware that some of the newbies in chat might be thinking, well, then the game's over. But no, this is not Werewolf. Um, the good team only has to kill the demon. And dead players get one vote for the whole of the rest of the game. So right now there are 11 eligible voters, even though there are only four living players. Good morning, Ravenswood Bluff. Bardic died in the night. There are four living players now. Just two votes Not required. Surprising. Okay, I, I don't I, think we can go tonight. I, I, I protected Bardic. Um, there's a poison still in play. Yeah. <laughs> no, okay. Mm -hmm. Are you claiming Mikuchi? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Here, Here's where I am at. I, uh, I'm, I put this in chat, but I'm going to say it for chat as well um i sincerely believe that it is a richie fearmonger link source spy wild star um as yeah. the yeah. um imp and the chef is the drunk okay i agree nikki that's what i was about to say as well i um, also that's why i wouldn't be you wouldn't risk executing me and being undertaker checked you'd rather kill me off at night yeah yeah um i think that works with all worlds that works with um, day one whispers as well the other Next. thing that is interesting is that Richie tried to nominate me and then realized that he had already nominated on day one when we believe that I was the person who was picked by the fearmonger. So, so just to clarify, well, like, I, I, I tried to yesterday, yesterday. Can I, I just clarify? No, no, let me finish, let me finish here. Just to clarify, the, the evil team yesterday, I was gunning hard for Wildstar to be killed off to force Wildstar to shoot her shot um, and no one went for that. You always have a blood bitchy, you pick your demon. No, no, you're we could not gonna happen. Also, you're just selling this world and you've just had me executed for no reason then? Hey, I'm not okay. saying. So I, I, I think there's a executed. there's a strong chance that we are in a world with all three evils alive, and therefore I think we should probably not go to sleep, to be honest. Uh, there is a world that does not contradict my fortune teller info. There is a single world that does not contradict my Wait. fortune teller info combined specifically with empath which, info. Which, Can which I is, say so something? tell us. Yeah, go on. Sorry. Um, so I'll just come out. I am the washerwoman, and I, I saw a monk between Richie and Wildstar. And my first, my day one chats with both of them, neither of them included monk and were being really kind of a little sketchy with me. And I didn't get Richie to claim to be a monk until later. So I may be drunk or i don't know but i if you all think i'm the spy that's fine but i know i'm a good person so please do not kill me that i can confirm that is exactly what happened she fished i noticed that and i just went nope not not buying it she then fished some more i then put monk in and she said you're the monk and i was like okay i trust you now she's either the spy not the demon or she's just the washerwoman right um yeah um, could we get the fortune teller info yeah, we really need that right now. Yep. Uh, night one, I chose Richie and Linksel. I got a no. Night two, I chose Ekin and Ed. I got a no. This is why I told Wildstar that she should shoot into the right side of the table. Uh, she chose to shoot Richie instead. I don't know why. Um, so this this yeah, world works. I, I heard a lot of Chris and Evie telling me to shoot away, and I got a bit flustered. I think... That was definitely a bad play on my end. I think Evie is probably evil, and that's why she was so desperate to avoid being Slayer shot. Okay, so if can, we can assume... we do a full round of all info because uh, I think it's a, there's a bits of information which are important. That I don't think everybody knows. Would you like me to ah. compare it? Yes. Yeah, okay. go for it. Going clockwise, Wildstar. Slayer, I shot Richie. Sorry. Uh, Virgin got nominated by Bardic, and Bardic didn't die. Bardic. She didn't die because I'm the saint. Icky. Uh, Ravenkeeper. Evie. Mayor. Briss. Empath. Zero on Evie and Nadine. Zero on Evie and Navian. One on Richie and Evie. Oh, we've just been raided. Thank you so hey. much for the raid, nice. Jamie. <laughs> Jamie Blood on the Clock Tower. Have you just been playing Blood on the Clock Tower, Jamie? Because if you have, that makes you a pretty cool dude. 
Just putting that out there. <laughs> Uh, all cool dudes play Clock Tower, everyone knows that. Uh, we're, we're nearing the end of, uh, of our Fearmonger reveal game, so stick around because it's pretty intense. Uh, sorry guys, back to the comparing. So Nadine. Oh, Chef would have won. Uh, Navian. Uh, fortune Teller chose Richie Linksel, no. Ekin Ed, no. Uh, Richie. Uh, Yamunk. Um... So, against my better judgment, Chris, then Evie, then Wildstar, then Bardic, which apparently missed. I, I think there's a poisoner. Librarian, uh, drunk between Linksel and Mickey. Linksel. Washerwoman saw Monk between Richie and Wildstar. And finally, Ed. Is now a good time to say that I'm actually the recluse? Um, <laughs> what? St sorry, I, I'm not. I just couldn't resist I'll it. I'll fight you. <laughs> I'll fight you. <laughs> And I will oh, fly over been... to the Great Britain, and I will fight you. It was so, so worth it. Uh, I'm The Undertaker, <laughs> confirmed Aggie, didn't speak to anyone Aggie spoke to on day one, so if you think that I'm evil, it has to have a spy. Uh, then saw Nikki, Ravenkeeper, Chris, Empath. And then you killed me, despite the fact I was confirmed, not the demon. So that was good. All right, so hey. here we are at the uh, four players left alive. I'm just going to go ahead and say nominations are open. You don't have to make them if you don't want to. I'm only voting on Wildstar here. Okay, so there's two worldviews that work with the information present. One is that uh, both Chris and I are good and healthy sober. Nadine is specifically the drunk. That it leaves the world of Richie... Uh, Linksel as minions, Wildstar as the demon. There's another world where Nadine is in fact also sober and healthy, so am I. Uh, so the chef one would have to be Chris and Evie, and that means that we would have killed one of the evils. So we have to make a decision about whether we're in this worldview or not. Mm -hmm. And we should execute today or not. In, we in are, the we are ignoring. Can I just? We are ignoring every worldview involving a poisoner. Any one of these people could be poisoned once, and we are in trouble. Uh, well, notably, fear. yeah, yeah. That's we know basically. for a fact it's a fearmonger. Mm -hmm. um, nothing else. That's the problem. It's I, not so, a baron. It might not it's be not a poisoner. Yeah, it's not a baron. Just, I, it might not be a poisoner because I could just be the drunk and Links is the sp Links is the spy. Which is why she kept at trying to get me to confirm Monk. Then explain so, the empath one on you, Richie. Well, Richie's selling, world, this world. Was, Richie's selling a world where he was poisoned last night, so Chris had to be poisoned the night that he got an empath one on Richie. Mm. Um, also, would perfectly work even without Linksel being the spy if Ekin's poisoned. If like Linksel could be an original demon in that world because Ekin can be poisoned, then. Uh, Chris poisoned at the relevant point. Do we think three evils are alive? Yeah, I can't see the town square yes, right now. I, th I think so. Okay, who do you guys want me to nominate? Wildstar is my best. Okay. Okay. Evie, 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 I'm just throwing it out there. One of me or Chris has to be evil in this world. Wildstar is making a relevant point because if I'm seeing him as, so as a sober empath, that means that it doesn't work with the other information. So. You've got an evil player dead. How, how is either Chris or Ed evil? Yeah. Because I'm seeing him as sober and the information doesn't all come together. Yes, it does. It does. What if, what if uh, Link's all strong? The world where I'm good, it doesn't no, come Nominate what, Wildstar what if... and I'll give you accusations. Yeah, I, would, I would like Evie okay. to nominate Evie Wildstar. Evie has nominated yeah. Wildstar. All right, tell us why, Evie. Um, we've had a lot of chat already. Um, I think a lot of it has been explained. The world does come together, and I would like Bardic and Navian to add to this. Hey. Okay. Jump in, guys. Uh, yeah, my fortune teller info makes it look like it's one of either Eevee or Wildstar. There's a couple of different worldviews that support that Wildstar could be uh, evil and specifically the demon. Bardic, anything to add before we turn it over? Yeah, there's also a world that all three of the information, uh, Chris, Evie, uh, Chris, Nadine, and Navian all work, and I think this still goes with this world. Okay, Wildstar. Well, so. I am pretty sure that Evie's the demon. She was really concerned about being Slayer shot, um, and really pushed hard against that, and Ice come easily to peer pressure, um, which is a demon -y thing to do. There's no harm in being shot if you're good. 
It just confirms you, especially if you are the mayor. Um, obviously, the worldview where I'm evil is perfectly functional. I don't care whether we kill or sleep today as long as we don't kill me. I'm uh, I, because either Chris or Ed is evil because Chris is confirming Evie as good and Ed is confirming uh, Chris is silver. Okay. Um, could I put my hand up, please? I'm. I can't. I'm not seated. I can't see the town square, but I'd like oh, to put my hand what's, up. What's happened? Um, my laptop's restarting and it's booted me off the town square. <laughs> okay. I'll uh, vote for you. Is there a way that I can my my, put my hand is hand up? up? I think you can. Uh, yeah, there is. When, when, as, 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 soon as, you, as soon as you hit start, it will let you. Yeah, you can you can do it for her when it passes her. Well, we all know that Evie's hand is up. Yeah. Uh, so wait for it to go past there. You see, uh, at the moment it changes. Now click on the cross. Links all. Okay. Can someone let me know who else voted? Six wait, Richie votes. Is enough. Okay. Everyone. Evie, Bardic, me, Bardic me, Nikki, yeah. you, Chris, Nadine, Richie all voted. That is six. Links all had her hand up and then dropped it. I was doing it for Evie since she wasn't there. Six votes is enough. Wildstar on the block. Any other nominations? Linksel, what world Wildstar are you living in right now? Wildstar nominates Evie. Wildstar has nominated Evie. Tell us why. Oh, do you want to remove dead votes, by the way? Yeah, I'll just... uh, Nikki, Nikki Chris, Nadine. Um, Evie is the demon. Uh, we can wait another day and try and confirm that tomorrow. But um, if you kill me right now, the game ends and good loses unless we get really lucky with a month. Um, so we kill this. I don't know we'd have enough votes to kill tomorrow if we tie at this point though, so I think we gotta go for this. Okay, Evie. In my defense, um, I think that I've been pretty transparent with my claims. Um, I hope that I say she read good because I know I am good on day one. I decided to go into a trust circle with Nikki and Chris and hard claim Maya. It's quite scary for me to be completely honest day one. And I think the way I've played has been indicative of someone who is actually a mayor. The reason why I didn't want to get shot was because there's no gar clearing me um, doesn't really help because there's no guarantee that I'll be there in final three to take the mayor victory. Okay, seven to execute, six to tie. I believe there's seven votes total, so... I won't be voting on myself. Then it's going to be tie. And I don't think Navian's going to vote, so... Okay, one is not enough. Whilst they're on the block. Me. I think it's reasonable to assume that that's not going to be beaten, so in five seconds I'll call it a day. I really hope I'm right. I don't like being wrong. Wildstar oh, no. is executed and dies. And the game is over, unsurprisingly. Oh. And congratulations go to the good team on their successful Yay! execution. Yay! Oh, Yay! Oh, thank God. Yay! <laughs> no, you can't. Oh, I'm God. sorry, Wildstar. <clears throat> well, um, let's do the roundup. So, we had Ekin, the librarian, who knew that either Bardic or... Uh, Linksel was the drunk. That drunk was, in fact, Linksel, the drunk washerwoman, yep. who mm -hmm. I told that either Wildstar or Richie was the monk too. The monk was a demon bluff. Wildstar, is, of course, was the imp. Richie was the scarlet woman. Uh, we had Navian, the fortune teller, who decided to pursue a strategy of choosing people that were, t like, two steps from one another to attempt to kind of pick people around an empath, if possible. So on night one, it was Richie and Linksel, which got a no. Uh, night two, it was Ekin and Ed, which got also got a no. Uh, and, of course, Wildstar was the imp. The next night, Navian probably would have chosen Linksel and Wildstar, and I felt that the evil team needed some help. So when Wildstar attacked Evie, the mayor in the night, I pinged it off onto Navian. We had Nadine the chef, who had got a one. That one was Wildstar the imp and Ed the fearmonger. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> Ed's longer oh. oh choice on night one was, was Ekin because Ekin. he said everyone yeah. is going to expect Nikki or Richie to be nominated so I'm going to choose Ekin and then push the world where it's probably on Nikki or Richie uh, and on day one he nominated Ekin and got five of the six votes required 
So yep. I think it was very real possibility that I was going to end early. I knew it. I'm sorry. I knew it. <laughs> to, to be fair, I said, hey, can this person nominate Ekin? Yeah. And you went, you no. Me, I hesitated. <laughs> and I had to written oh, down as a worth a try. Monger, like midway through the day because yeah. this girl is obviously the washerwoman. Yeah. <laughs> obviously had a ping on me and Richie. So I was like, cool. So Richie's the poisoner, Ed's the peer, peer monger, and we're fine. Well, Ed didn't yeah. give up his chances of uh, ending the game early. He then switched it to Linksall on night three uh, and nominated <laughs> Linksall, but it only got one vote from Ed. <laughs> yeah. Had, um, <laughs> I was Ed. trying to out as Fearmonger so that people would believe it and then get Wildstar to Star Pass. Um, that was the, the thing I was going for then. Oh. No, but there was a Scarlet Woman. <laughs> I know. But, yeah, it would be fun. We had Chris the Empath, uh, who got a zero and then a zero, and then finally when his name was Richie, a one. Uh, Nikki the Ravenkeeper, who nominated himself, uh, and finally Aggie the Virgin, who was nominated on day one by the Saint, an outsider, therefore her ability did not go off. Uh, and that Sorry, was Aggie. Nightmares Brewing. I uh, I hope you enjoyed the paranoia. Hold on, was, was I not um, even seen by the librarian? I thought it was Nikki. Yes, you were. Yes, uh, you I'm were. looking at stream yeah, right now. Oh, okay. Whistle or Nikki, who was seen by the librarian. I, got, I, got, I was, was going to say, my whole thing would have been wasted. Yeah. Whew, well, Ed, look at that, you, it's exactly you, midnight. How did you know five? Nikki was the Raven Keeper? Nikki oh, he, told he me knew. he was the Raven Keeper. It was oh, Aggie no. that I was... Aggie, <laughs> yeah. was the, Aggie was the one I was chancing it on. I'd not spoken right. to Aggie, and I just, yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, Had I to was get also have spoken to Norman Richie. My but, yeah. god. <laughs> My god. All right, well, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you very much for coming and hanging out. Big thanks to all the subs. I'm very sorry that I didn't give you all shout-outs. Uh, it's, been, it's been pretty intense. Um, but yeah, this this uh, Fortnite stream contest will be to make us a script that has a fearmonger in it. There is a hell of a lot of material to work with there, guys. Have fun making that. Uh, head on over to the unofficial server, which I'm sure someone will link very kindly for us. Um, can, we, can we raid Jet Bones? He's my boy. Sure, why not? <laughs> Drop me a link. We'll make it happen. Um, yeah. Tune in on Sunday because it's the US stream. Uh, thanks a lot. Look after each other and stick around because we're going to raid Jet and his bones in a minute. Bye-bye.